Welcome to Cute Fast Track Series for API Recommended Practice 578. In this lecture, we will discuss the evaluation of testing results. This section provides an overview of the general structure of the text in Clause 7, as well as reviews of some of the important sub-clauses that are in the clause. The following is a list of all the sub-clauses as listed in the table of contents. The text portion of is distributed amongst two sub-clauses. In the following slides we highlight important information contained in Clause 7 accompanied by the sub-clauses. Material acceptance methods The owner user may elect any one of the following methods of material acceptance. Materials can be confirmed to contain the nominal amounts of alloying elements specified in the relevant materials specification, for example ASME Section 2 or ASTM specifications. Materials can be classified through a qualitative sorting technique to establish the conformance with the intended material. When PMI indicates that alloying elements are outside the ranges indicated in the material specification, owner user may provide person knowledgeable of the appropriate damage mechanisms, confirms that the material will perform satisfactorily in the service. If testing using one of the portable or qualitative analysis methods leads to the potential rejection of a component, a more accurate analysis may be used to determine component acceptance. Follow-up positive material identification after discovery of a nonconformity. If any one of a representative sample is rejected, all items of that inspection lot should be considered suspect. A more extensive inspection of the remaining lot should be considered. Review questions. Question number one. What is an acceptable method of material acceptance? Answer is D. Question number two. You are the QA inspector of a new construction project and have been informed that some fittings were PMI tested and the alloying elements are outside the ranges that allowed in the ASTM material specification. Could these fittings still be used for your project? Answer is C. Question number three. You are testing one representative fitting from a lot and find it rejectable. You should. Answer is B. Question number four. What is the appropriate action to take when an incorrect material is located during a PMI sampling of an inspection lot? Answer is D.
This lecture is prepared by Samir Saad, and this is his profile. Thanks a lot for watching, and please waiting us for next lecture.